It is pressure cooker time in the Champions League. Four teams are left and the stage is set for an enthralling semi-final. Who will make it through to the showpiece event? It's Arsenal. They take on Newcastle United live on EA TV. Good evening. Tonight, the spotlight falls on North London. We find ourselves at the home of Arsenal. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting next to me with his tactics charts at the ready is Stuart Robson. And now things get really exciting on the UEFA Champions League front. We're at the semi-final stage, and what we have coming up is the first leg. It's Arsenal up against Newcastle United. Well, Derek, they don't come much bigger than this, do they? This will be a top-quality game between two of the best sides in Europe. And a chance, Odegaard! And you've got to credit that magnificent piece of defending. And so the starting 11 for Arsenal. Martin Odegaard plays alongside Declan Rice in central midfield. And the main forward is Gabriel Jesus. Well, they know how to pass the ball and at pace. But then the commentator's curse comes into play. And this is the initial 11 for the visitors today. Well, it's the same formation, but they use it to press the ball high up the field. And rarely do the wide players drop deep to defend. And watch out for the midfield three who continually rotate their positions. Chance to play it in. Well, acres of space out wide for Newcastle. And a goal! The opener in the semi-final. First goal of the contest. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. Well, that reaction says it all. That's such an important goal in this game. 1-0 then. Saka. And continues his run. Havertz. The crowd encouraging him to take his own. Angles it back. Can he take the chance? They just couldn't stay in front. And now this match is all square. Well, here it is again. And the defending simply isn't good enough. They have to react quicker, deal with the danger and show more urgency. None of which they did. And that's the result. So back underway, one goal apiece here. Making use of his physical strength to hang on to it. Oh, but they've lost it now. That's really good and effective physical play. Guimaraes. On to Almiron. Well, made it look routine, but read it well. Havertz. Now Zinchenko. An encouraging Arsenal move. Crossing opportunity. It looked as though they had attacking momentum, but not so. Long stuff. Could be a chance to break here. Jamal Lascelles. Moving the ball nicely. Looking for that final pass. And space to cross it. That's a very fine piece of tackling. Long stuff. In possession to give them the lead, maybe. Trippier.
Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Jesus. Isaac. Might really be able to trouble them here. Must be terrific piece of anticipation. That is that for the first half here. Underway in the second half here at the home of Arsenal. Decisive in the tackle and a throw in here. Gabriel White shielding the ball superbly Bukayo Saka and it will be an Arsenal free kick dealt with that ball comfortably Trippier Longstaff Arsenal have possession again well the perfect tackle really and now a throw in Gabriel Martinelli how can he take them on and beat them? And Arsenal have won the corner as they try to take the lead. Well, this is a big moment, and don't these fans know it? A short corner here. Marcinelli. And tidy defensive play. Almiron. Longstaff. Here's Isaac. Longstaff. Now with Almiron. Surely! And there is the goal to re-establish their advantage! Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. Well, it's a big moment for him. Just needs to get his players refocused now. Arsenal restart the game then. And they have work to do as they try to wipe out that last goal. Declan Rice. Now with Havertz. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Bukayo Saka could be dangerous oh that's fine defensive play Isaac 
And what can they do to stop him running at them? Joel Linton. Chance for Isaac. Well, this game is far from over. They'll probably get one more big chance before the end. The crowd certainly thinks so. Just listen to that noise. Crossing possibilities. Trippier. And quick thinking defensively. Gabriel Jesus. Textbook closing down, and now they're on the attack. Roberts. This could square the game, and it has! Such late excitement, and no wonder they're jumping for joy as we speak. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. Well, you can see his frustration. They've just lost their focus here. So underway again, and it's a story of parity. Two goals apiece in this one. Almiron. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, three minutes to be added on. Long stuff. The emphasis very much on attack. Almiron. Isaac. Joel Linton. Looks as though there might be a threat, but not so in the end. Good defending. And there's the final whistle. A thoroughly entertaining semi-final first leg. And I must say, Stuart, it bodes well for the return match. Yeah, fantastic first 90 minutes, wasn't it? Exactly what you want to see at this stage of the competition. Let's just hope they can replicate that in the reverse fixture.